Good morning, folks. This is Ron from Ron's RC Channel. We're at the, you know, the beautiful uh, Margate City Beach. Uh, it's summer, uh, July uh, 2017. Uh, I'm at um, one of the lifeguard stations here. Um, I'm about to fly an exciting new quadcopter, the Hubson 51A um, High Edition or Wi-Fi edition. Um, I'm going to fly it with the, uh, the transmitter and I'm going to fly it with a Google tablet. Um, I know you're going to say this doesn't fit in here but uh, it doesn't matter if it fits in here. I just start it all up, put this in my pocket and then fly with the, with the tablet. Nobody says that in the videos but uh, it, I've tried it and it works. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to turn this device on here you can see the lights there and then we're going to turn the quad on get that all strapped away inside there perhaps it doesn't give you a whole lot of room okay then we're going to get the tab on here open up the Hubson app and uh, Gonna go to this turn to pick the Wi-Fi network first. Uh, hold on, went out of order there. Got to get the pick the Wi-Fi network first. Here yeah, I picked the controller, which is Hubson HT005, and not the quad. Hope you can see that. Okay, now it's it's all connected. You can see the green light on here indicating that we're connecting well. Okay, enter device. Uh, hit the uh, camera. Okay, it's already wanting me to start to do calibration, so let me take, uh, Hubson's a real finicky on their calibration, so let me take my keys and phone out of my pocket here. I'm going to put the uh, good landing pad down here first. Let's get our south east west there we go got our directions right got it got to be precise you know so okay let's get this calibration going here all right slowly and levelly hold the hustle with hands like this until the lights stop flashing. So these Hubsons, they're a little hard to uh, get a good compass calibration on. They have uh, easy to get the toilet, T E B, toilet, toilet pole effect. So let's see here. Let's keep going. Keep going. Keep going. I have to edit this video down. There it went. Lights are, lights are good. So hopefully we got a good calibration with no toilet, toilet bowl affecting. I can't say that word. Alrighty, so now I'm going to take the range extender. Just stick it in my uh, cargo pocket here. And... Okay, it wants me to bind to the aircraft now. Probably can't see this screen. Okay, he wants me to test GPS accuracy. Let's do it. It's testing GPS accuracy. Everything's good. I never know why I don't get... Oh, there, there we go. I don't know why I don't get my maps from Google there, but uh, we'll work on that later. All right, we have a... Uh, and I hope you can 
see this stuff here. Um, we have an uh, automatic takeoff here. So let's do the automatic t takeoff. There it goes. There it is. Taking up a little bit, now a little bit. Now she seems steady. Seems like she's hovering good. Hopefully I got a good calibration in. So, um... Let me try even a little bit of a range test here today, fellas. So let me uh, start my recording. Okay, we're recording a little bit, so let's. Uh, I'm going to use the uh, you know the stick on here. So let's see. Let's take her up a bit. There she goes. Let's take her out just a little bit. Make sure she's flying good. She's supposed to get 400 meters with this um, tablet, so oops. So let's see, uh, once we make sure she's flying good, we're going to say, give her a little bit of a range test. We may not go 400 meters, but, you know, we'll go a bit. She seems to be handling pretty good. She seems nice to study. Let's take her up a bit more. Alright, she's up to about 20 meters now. I'll go about maybe 25 meters. Alright. Carry right, down about 25, 26 meters. You probably got a little bit better view here. So let's, let's take her out a bit now. I got her at 250 meters. Pretty good, as Pete would say. Pretty good. Uh, still getting video. Let's, let's stop that video. And take a nice picture. There we go. All right. Back to video, I think. All right. I think we're recording video. Hold on.
You know what? I'm not sure if we're recording or not. I don't think we're recording. Hope I record this whole thing here. Uh, so let's do the old return to home. She's 250 meters out. Let's see how she does. Yeah. Come on back. We're at 73% battery life. So let's see here. She brought herself down a little bit. And I don't want to land. She didn't do a return to home, she just started landing. Well, that's not good. Let's bring her home. There she comes. All right, she's close again. Let's see if we can start recording again. Nah, I don't know if I got a memory card full. It's not giving me a memory card error, but... I'm not recording video anymore. I don't know if I was ever recording video. So let's, um... Let's see if this is the return to home. Uh, automatic return to home. Oh, I think I hit the wrong button before. So let's, uh... See how she does. Okay, she's turning around to face me. There she comes. Hope you hope I got the hat cam pointed at her. There she comes. Like mostly, she kind of hangs there a little bit while, and now she's coming down. I think I can. Let me cancel her since she's going to hit the, the thing. She may have came down on her. I thought she was going to hit the lifeguard stand, but uh, I think she had been okay. Let's see if I can land her on this pad. Didn't mean to land her in the sand, that's for sure. <laughs> 